Make sure they take card. So let's go in. I have the chicken. Is it good? So we came to the commercial center to try this food that is uh, famous by the locals. It's called Cafe Restaurante Martino de Acada. We're gonna try the cod, fried cod, and coffee. Hot dish, cookie miniature. These are the famous cod cookies. Very chewy and at the same time, you can taste like the, the, the dough, the bread, but at the same time, very chewy. It's very good. And the potatoes. Must try. Very, very good. And the coffee. I got the espresso. Wow. I accidentally put a lot of sugar, but it's a very strong espresso. Small and good. Gonna wake me up and give us all the energy for the day. Now we're by the famous stand that the, uh, you can make the juice by buying so right next to the Bellum Tower right there. And that's the you have five euros, Joe? You want to make the big one or yeah, the small one? the big one. Cute? Because we can... <laughs> so, let's see. Oh my god. So fresh. Can stop drinking. Yeah, you too. Thank you so much. I think it's amazing. It is so refreshing and hydrating. And I we feel got like, which one did we get? Uh, we got the pineapple something. But the people were very nice and they treated us very good. So come when you come to the Bellum Tower, stop by and get the juice. After all the lines, pastille de blend. So let's see how it tastes. Oh my god, look at that. That's two. You can hear the crunchiness. Very fresh. Very fresh. Warm. Oh my god. Wow. It's so warm. The inside, the cream filling, it is very hot. This is the the best one we have so far and it's a must you come and try it because it's located right next to the monastery that's the monastery this is it so i'm having a sardine sandwich and you're having chicken with rice Let's see. soft and very flavorful let me show so it has the sardine it has eggs and all the veggies very very flavorful so now i'm gonna enjoy it <laughs> the food was delicious and we demolished it. gone gone how satisfied are you very eight out of nine excitement we need excitement this was delicious food the sardine was very good it has eggs and everything inside very nutritious and the chickens had a lot of herb and sauce in it that was wonderful and it was the best now we're full now we need to exercise and walk so this place is called timeout they have different stalls with fruits meat that they cook most of the meat is pork so we just chose a fish and shrimp so we're gonna eat that 
but this is a good place if you especially if you're a pork lover and you like meat you can come and enjoy this place it's pretty nice you can get free samples of everything as you walk around So we ate our food and drink. We had a good time here at Time Out. So now we're going to Cantino di Do Aziz. Cantino do Aziz is a Mozambique slash Portuguese food place. So we're going to have some nice, uh, maybe sambosa, maybe some lamb. Oh, we have an Indian infusion also. Oh, so it's Mozambique. Samosa is not Mozambique and Portuguese, it's Indian. Okay, Indian slash Mozambique slash Portuguese food that we're gonna head right now. It's almost nine o'clock, but... Um, it's almost 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. <laughs> we ate right at this place, but now we're gonna get more food. These bikes are badass. Going up the hill. It is quite the stairs up, but we finally made it to see Cancido Aziz. So let's see, let's try this food. This is the place. The same guys. Oh, television? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Speak, speak. <laughs> Sorry? So you, we make YouTube oh, videos. Oh, yeah. You yeah. don't see? So you're going to have bakra piri piri. Do you know? Piri piri. It's a lamb rib in a red spicy sauce and vegetables served with rice so it is spicy and i'll be getting woo amendoya i thought you said woo, woo amendoya so it is a boneless chicken boneless chicken breast cooked in a coca and peanut sauce with vegetables served with rice and if you were just wondering why mike is looking like he's glowing like a goddess <laughs> This is the spicy sauce. Mm. It, it, smells, it smells like uh, tomato sauce and sriracha together. That's how it smells like. Also, it's hot. So let's try. Cheers. I think he's gonna burn his mouth. Very good. Very spicy. It is spicy. But it's very good. This is how the food looks. That was the hottest film I've ever done. How is very it? fresh. Yeah, very fresh and tender and flavorful. I'm gonna try the lamb she has. The meat just falls off the bone. It is so spicy and so good. Mm. You can taste the chicken and the coconut and peanuts. Delicious. So this is our third day. Before we go to Sintra, we're gonna go have breakfast at a famous place called Fibrisa Lisboa. The eggs and fresh avocado and avocado bread. How is it? So good. Amazing. For me, I would have I would preferred a little bit more salmon. Very delicious, but a bit sweeter for my taste. So we just had our breakfast. Enjoyed my toast. I think it was really good. I enjoyed the coffee. The croissant was a little bit sweet for my liking, but that's because I don't like a lot of sweets. Another important thing is just bring cash because they only take cash. Thank you. 
And look at this cool art. It says Portugal. So this is not really liquor, right? It's used for medicinal purposes, but it does have liquor in it. So whenever you're feeling under the weather, you would drink this and... You're not supposed to drink it like a shot. It's not a shot. Shit, I think I'm gonna get two more. <laughs> How much did we pay for this? We paid about 140. <laughs> what is this made of? This one is a sour cherries. Uh huh. And the grappa, the Portuguese grappa, I went into this one here. Uh huh. And you put the sugar and they wait five, five or six months for the maceration, the, the cherry. Five to six months? Yes. Wow. This is homemade. Mm. Thank you.